Hey guys, Rick van Sonis here, back for another video. In this video, we'll be making this future browser template. So if you want FOP right away, make sure to download it for free down below. In this video, we'll be going over the drums, the basses, the leads, and effects. So the final result will sound like this. If you want to download this FOP for free, make sure to check the link down below. So now let's dive into the drums. First of all, we got Skeg Drum. We EQ it like this, cut off some highs to make room for the sponge kick. Together, sound like this. In the Skeg, we cut out all the lows, like this. So together they sound like this. Bust to this kick bus with some compression. And we boost up the mids like this. Then we added the claps. So this one and this one. So we got one clap for the mids. It's a cute, I guess. And then we got a higher clap, sounding like this. And the cute, I guess. Together, they routed to this bus with low cut, some reverb, some saturation, and some more EQing. Then we added this drop clap, sound like this. It really fills up the drums. So it only got a low cut, and the volume is really low. So it's only to fill it up, as you can hear. Then we added a crash. You can barely hear it. And then the last thing we have in the drums are these toms. These toms give us some more groove, so sound like this. So this one for the lows and this for the highs. Now together the drums sound like this. So now let's have into the bass lines. Together they sound like this. So there are two serum presets, one for the sub and one for the main bass. Sound like this. And it's this messed up kind of sub. So by the way the presets are coming from Future Bounce Frame 2. If you want the preset pack, make sure to check the link down below. So the sub is processed like this. Basically there's only a sidechain on it. Then we got the main bass sounding like this. It's a preset inspired from Rock Cut by Mike Williams and it makes like this. So it only got a low cut and we cut it off some highs to make room for the leads. As you can hear. And then we ride it to the bus with some more low cuts. A bit of reverb and delay. Some more low cuts and a accelerator and then we sidechain it. So all together, sound like this. And let's see for the bass line. Together with the drums, they sound like this. So now let's dive into the leads. Together, they sound like this. So there's, it's a layer of three sound presets. All coming from Fuji Pass Frame 2, so Make sure to check out the pack. So the first one sound like this. Second one I guess. And the last one is a kind of whistle kind of sound. So the first two are processed like this. One is pan to the right. And right to this drop lead. So first cut is EQ. Boosting a bit of mids and some sound glazer. Then this guitar amp, some sidechain, low cuts, not low cuts, some more acceleration, and a limiter. Then it's right to the lead bus. It's only there for filtering and reverb delay. 
with low cards after the delay, so there's no lows in the in the reverb and delay, and then a side chain, and then we got a whistle preset, something like this, and processed like this with some reverb, synthesizer, low cuts, kick start, camera crusher, and the stereo shaper to make it really wide. And together they sound like this. And then the last thing we did to the synth is automate this reverb mix. So every time the note ends, the reverb comes up. It really gets some more energy to the lead. So with the basses, it sounds like this. And really fills the gaps between the notes. So now let's dive into the effects. So the last thing we added to the drops are the effects. You can barely hear it, but it really fills up the drop. So first, we got its chord steps. This one and this lower one together sound like this. Then you got this downlifter. It's kind of white noise effect. Then this crash. It's just to fill it up in this crowd effect to fill it up even more. Then we got this referral synth and this uh, synth fill from Cashmere. Something like this. And all together, this sounds good. And that's already it for the effects. So all together, the drops sound like this. And that's already it. So, so if you want to download this FP for free, make sure to check the link down below. And if you like the video, please leave a like. If you want to see more, hit that subscribe button. And I'll see y'all next videos.